Hello. All right, so you haven't seen this before. Probably. Unless you happen to know me from one of my other uh, random non-fur accounts. Uh, anyway, Anime Expo is coming up in a few days now. <sighs> um, and this here is my Azrael Dreamer head that I made. Um, I brought him out last year, and I just added the lines today. Well, not today. I added it like a couple weeks ago or something. Um, anyway, the point is that I apologize for not having more frequent uploads. Um, I was hoping to... Uh, I have a couple projects that are reliant on guests, and unfortunately it's been really difficult to kind of coordinate that, uh, especially in the summer, people have all kinds of different plans and stuff. Um, but uh, thanks for hanging on if you've been sticking around, uh, because the, the first one should be quicker and easier, and I think getting that done will be a lot smoother. The second one requires a lot of coordination, but I think it'll be a lot of fun when you guys actually see it. Um, Anyway, so this is just a quick apology video just to let you know that I'm still alive. I do have plans coming on to the channel, and I have guests that are going to come in, which will be fun. Just some friends and stuff. Nothing, like, huge and groundbreaking, but it'll be fun. Um, and I also just wanted to let you know that in case it's kind of, like, staggered for a while, it's because of my cosplay plans, and I'm going to be at Anime Expo for uh, all of the days that we're there. Um, so days one through four, and then either day negative one now, or... Uh, day zero for badge pickup. Um, if you are going to be at Anime Expo and you see me and you want to say hi, feel free. Um, I'll be with my brother for most of the days, probably. Uh, day one, I'm going to be dressed as Halucha from Pokemon. Um, anyway, um, I designed some stuff and had like authentic, actual wrestling gear made off of my designs. I think it was Elucha. Um, I sent the designs to and they made it for me. So it was really, really cool, and they're all totally unique and authentic. Um, and I'll be there, and my brother is going to be dressed as Incineroar, so we're going to have a really cool wrestling team for the Pokemon cosplay gathering. Uh, so that's going to be cool for you. So if you want to see me, look for a Halucha. That's me, and I'll be with an Incineroar. So if you want to keep an eye out for those two, you'll know which one we are. Um, day two, I'm going to be Azrael Dreamer, wearing my Azrael suit that I made. I just touched it up. Um... Last year, you, you met, if you you know if you went or saw it online or something, you might recognize the head. But I touched it up. I gave it the black lines, and then I've got a little bit of updating done to the suit. The uh, collar has like I have a collar now, <laughs> among other things. That was the big one. I didn't have a collar last year, um, and I got some fur hands made by a good friend of mine um, who really saved my life with that because I I quite like how my feet turned out and other parts of the suit, but I just couldn't figure out hands for the life of me. And she just stepped up and took my quick last minute commission from her and uh it looks great and it actually matches the fur really well so that's totally totally perfect um so yeah look if look for my asriel um partial if you want to say hi whatever um it'd be cool and i like bumping into people and talking cosplay and outfits and all kinds of stuff um so yeah that'll be day two day three i'm gonna be brooke from one piece so look for a skeleton i might not have my violin i might depends um, and if I have it, I probably won't play it, and if I play it, I won't play it well, because I'm a brass player since fourth grade, and I touched a string instrument for the first time to play it, like, two or three days ago when I bought the thing, <laughs> second hand, so it's not really great quality, it's just like a really cheap second hand, heavily used student violin, but, uh, it's, it's a good, it's good, it looks good too, that'll be the important thing. Uh, day four, I'm going to be an immortal from Jet Set Radio Future. Uh, if you know that series, then you are awesome. My brother and I were huge, huge fans for the longest time. We loved Jet Grind Radio, and then we picked up Future, and uh, Future was probably both of our favorites. I can't really speak for him, but it was my favorite because it obviously was bigger and had more depth to it. Uh, anyway, so yeah, I just wanted to give you a quick little video uh, letting you know that, yeah, I apologize for not having frequency or any real content available right now. I'm going to get back to Night in the Woods just to have something to do uh, for the channel that's still kind of fur-related, sort of. Um, I might get some videos of the con if I can. Uh, most of my costumes are heavily enclosed, so it might be difficult, and the only thing I could really record with or snap photos with is my phone at the moment, so I might not be able to really do that too, because I know that a couple of the suits I have won't be able to react with my phone. Um, but at any rate, you know, I'll look for cool stuff. Hopefully I can get some shots or something. I'll show you guys. Um, either way, I'll let you have, I'll, you know, I'll give you a rundown video after the con and everything. 
and I will definitely have at least one of the vi one video from the new things that I'm two new things that I'm planning uh, after July fourth. So at some point uh, within the week, maybe by the next weekend, which would be about July eighth, I believe. Um, oh yes, and actually, there's an LA fur meet that I'm trying to make that is on the eighth. So I might actually get a meet uh, get some meat footage up, which sounds really gross now that I think about it. <laughs> anyway. Uh, might, yeah, I could probably bring my GoPro for that, actually. So there might be some fur meat photos, or video, or both. Uh, anyway, uh, thank you for sticking around if you stuck around with me. Uh, and I apologize again, because I really feel bad for starting it and feeling like it was going fairly well, and then kind of slowing down pretty heavily. Uh, but either way, thanks for hanging around with us. And by us, I mean me, unless you include... My beloved little Pomchi, who is in his bed right now, so again, I'm not going to bother him. Um, but yeah, anyway, uh, I hope you guys have a really great day. Um, just bear with me until after the con. We'll have more frequent footage and stuff to post up videos, um, maybe more game stuff if it goes well. If not, I'll just stop it with Night in the Woods, but I'm going to finish Night in the Woods anyway. And uh, yeah, I hope to see you at the con if you guys are going. Uh, let me know if you're going to be there and what you're going to cosplay as if you like cosplay, because I have always adored cosplay. Um, at the very least, come say hi to me in my Azrael outfit. Um, you guys are the best, um, because you guys are just cool. I don't know any of you, except for like two of you. But, thank you. This is awkward. So, goodbye, and have a great day, and I hope to see you at Con again.